What's up, guys? What's and up? Hello. What's good? Our yeah. huge Airbnb here. Oh, and welcome to what is the start of the most insane day of this basketball season. It's UNC Duke. It's the Final Four. I'm currently in a massive Airbnb in Gulfport, Mississippi, just about an hour from New Orleans. And we have like 20 people staying in this house. We're about to head to the city and get ready to watch the most anticipated March Madness game of all time in person. Let's freaking go. This is going to be my first time in Louisiana. Obviously, the Superdome is such an iconic venue, so I'm excited on all fronts. I'm just praying we don't lose by like 30. Um, with all that said, let's head to New Orleans. Okay, we have made it to downtown NOLA. We explored Bourbon Street, Canal Street, Jackson Square, all the good stuff. Got some Cajun food. The vibes are really high. There's people from like every team here that are just chanting their team's cheers, bantering, it's awesome. And now it's like, and now it's like four o'clock and we are heading to the Superdome because even though our game starts at eight central, our tickets are valid for Kansas Villanova as well. Hey, being able to go to two final four games for 40 bucks, that's a pretty sweet deal. <laughs> Okay, so we are in, and we got our seats for this game, and they said section 135, and I was like shook, because I expected them to give us the worst seats possible, and I was like, lower level? Wow. But then we walked down, and uh, these were our seats. Yeah, as you can see, like 70% of it is blocked by another section, so that actually makes more sense now, and then from there, we can walk right down to the student section after this game finishes. But there's still like 20 minutes before tip-off and I'm gonna explore this insane stadium for a bit. I took the elevator up to the top floor and we're gonna check this out for the first time together. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Is unbelievable. It looks so high because because the basketball court's like half the size of the football field that's usually in here. But wow, I can't believe I'm here right now. If you can't tell already. It's surreal too because this stadium has so much history with obviously Super Bowls hosted in it but not only that just Katrina and everything that has happened here and how much, how much the Saints and the Super don't mean to the city of New Orleans so pumped. Alright, fast forward there is two minutes left in the Kansas Nova game. Kansas is up by 13, they're gonna win. Cooper, my good luck card. I can't believe I'm here. I can't believe we're here. Oh, I can't believe it. Either. Heels! Oh, heels! Oh, the Nova students. Heels!
looking up and seeing that we're in the middle of 70,000 people right now. Yeah, and we moved up a bit. Let's go. Let's go. A little bit of a seat upgrade. Don't do it! Oh. Okay. Okay. 
It's almost 1 a.m. We just got off Bourbon Street with Garrison. Let's go, man. A few other fans. Let's go, let's go. And holy crap, I think it's starting to settle in now. That was real. That happened. Um, yeah. Going to the Natty. We're, li we're, going we're literally to the going to the national championship. I would never thought I would have said that during college, but here we are. Also, I don't think I mentioned it, but today's my birthday. Um, like when it turned midnight, it hit my birthday. So that was the best start to a birthday. I probably could have asked for it. Let's go. All right, I'm just gonna end it here. Go Heels. I'll see you all on Monday. This was the most fun sports game I've ever been to. Um, well, let's win it all. All right, thank you all so much for watching. Peace out. Bye.